On a fine autumn day, this is a good place to be. It's a place called Mosserville. Lots of folks named Mosser live here. Vernon is one of those Mossers, and on a day like this, neighbors will be stopping by to see him. They will wait patiently for Vernon to crank up the old hit-and-miss engine in the shed alongside Black Hole Creek. It'll start. It has been starting since 1927. If you understand it, it's fairly simple and easy. But you have to know how to set the controls and so forth. When that old engine fires up, it means that someone has brought in another load of apples. It is the busy season for a custom apple presser. In fact, Vernon can't remember a year when it hasn't been busy, when he hasn't been here, turning apples into cider. Yeah, I can remember well, uh, making cider. My father would happen to be away, a customer would come, and I'm 10, 11 years old, would have to have help to start the engine. Vern's place is a sign of the season, a sound of the season. The putt of the old hit and miss engine, the slap of the belts, the click click of all those gears. They say, better than any calendar, that autumn has come to this place again, much the same as it has for the past five decades or so. They say that it is time for new cider, the nectar of this season. It's good to know that all is normal in Mosserville, that Vernon and his cider press have marked another autumn for us. Tradition would have it no other way. My father did it, and I fear I'm honoring my father by following in his footsteps. Autumn is a good time of year here, don't you think? I'm Mike Stevens, Newswatch 16, on the Pennsylvania Road in Union County.